Howdy y'all, my name's Gamer James, and welcome back to Let's Play One Shot! So, when last we left off, we had just left the sun, the literal sun, with a plant lady who was on her last leg, shall we say. Or, however you want to say that. But, we got that with her, and I just got spit on my screen again. <laughs> Nabbit. So, we have those same mysteries. We didn't really solve any of the mysteries last time. What is taming? We got a little bit of explanation there, but not a whole lot. Who is the author? And who are Silver and Kip? I still don't know that. And one I forgot to mention. What is that entity in the computer? I f in the computers that we find. I feel like we're not going to find that out until the very end. Or close to the very end. But I am still curious. But in the meantime, we got some uh, things we got to do. We got a goat herder who needs our help. And... A goat that needs some serious help. We got a trader who we could probably give something valuable and get something valuable to us in return. And we got somebody offering us stew. So I just wrote those down to keep that in mind. Also, I looked up the names of these two newest characters, Calamus and his little sister Alula. Turns out those names have actual meanings. They're referring to, uh, I think, parts of a bird anatomy. So that's pretty cool, I think. Besides being cute names, Alula is a cute name, and Alcalamus just sounds like a cool name to me. But I didn't realize, I, I, I'd heard the term Alula before, but not Calamus, so I didn't realize they actually are referring to birds in some sense. Anyway, enough talk, let's get back into this. We got a little sister to bring back to her brother. I'm still here, I'm still here, Nico. Do not fear, Nico. I'm back! I don't think anyone else is noticing it either. Am I the only one who's seen this? That comes with the messiah territory basically all right lula lula well here's our main mission right now is to get her back to her family to her brother he's adorable by the way so i should mention that that little bit of cubes what is up with all the cubes here i don't get that okay your brother i think he's here i think we're right next to him i'm not sure hello okay that's where i'm going when I get something to write with. Because reasons. Oh. I can't sleep now, James. I need to get a little into her brother first. Okay, fine. That's what I was planning anyway. Oh, here's a, here's a bridge. She's still with us? Yeah, okay. Thank you. Thank you, got little wingy things. She's wearing their wing-like clothing. Hey, look who's here. Calamus! <clears throat> Calamus! Alola! You're okay! Thank goodness. The, again, the bird eyes kind of match their eyes. I was trapped inside this room and it was really scary. But then the Messiah saved me! He's, he's the Messiah, not me. But I helped him. <laughs> trapped? In the ruins? Yeah. There's that weird stuff in the door. You know, the floating squares we see next to the ocean sometimes? Hmm. The stuff you told me to stay away from? What? Oh. <laughs> Charlie Brown eyes now. It's spread to the ruins now? This isn't good. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. I'm not hurt or anything. Still, if it gets any worse, we might have to find somewhere else to live. What is this square stuff exactly bad well yeah anything that touches them just sort of gets messed up whenever you hear what people say the world is decaying that's what they meant what so it's decay in the purest form is what it is obviously you should avoid them too so is it like that movie pick i forget what it's called pixels or something pac-man Bite your hand and it gets all pixelated. Somebody go, this monster! Okay. <clears throat> I will. Anyway, uh... <laughs> I can't thank you enough for rescuing my sister, Savior. Just call me Nico. Oh, gosh. Would it not be rude to call you by name? Huh? Jesus, doesn't mind. <laughs> Why would it be? I mean, I'm just a kid like you guys. Ah. Uh, then, would you like to visit our home, Nico? Yes, he would. I mean, yes, I would. Yay! Let's go! It's like visiting Mary and Martha's house. Hey, these connections to the New Testament story are going to keep on coming in. I love it. So, just so you know. Oh, shoot! Looks like we can't get past that block. 
Seriously? <laughs> I'll be up ahead. <clears throat> I have literally never thought of that. You gotta get used to all the debris after living here for a while. Come on, our house isn't far from here. <laughs> oh, just kick, just kick the block. I would have told you to do that. Have we been here? So, uh, welcome to our home. I know it's not much, but feel free to make yourself comfortable. Ah, there it is. Uh-oh, you gonna give me something? Here, we want you to have this. You, oh. Oh, the magic feather. Oh. There's my ring game moment for this video. Oh, a feather. The edges are glowing yellow. It's a sacred feather from the great prophet. Prophet, oh, that's a new mystery. Oh, yeah. She's this old lady our dad used to know. Her feathers can glow in the dark and she can see into the future. What? Or something like that. She gave one of her feathers to father before she died. Oh, she's okay. Father wanted to pass this down as an heirloom, although it feels more fitting for you to have it. Are you sure? Totally sure! I think that's what father would have wanted. Oh, oh, oh. Thank you! I'm not sure how I should feel about people giving me these things. That's first the ro robot lady gave us the, this amber. Now they gave us a long slender feather with glowing edges. Where did this journal come from? Oh, it's just found in the barrens. I forget about that. It's good to be home again! Oh, by the way, what happened to the sun? I lent it to someone in the ruins. She said she wanted to feel the sun again before she... Oh, you must be talking about Maze. Maze? Is that her name? She's a powerful plant spirit. She used to protect the Glen. But once the sun died, her health rapidly deteriorated. Oh. I'm glad you were able to find her in time. I think we might already be... Be already too late to save her. I know. But I'm glad she got to see the sun again. Her name is Maze. That, that's corn, isn't it? Hope the squares don't spread too fast. There's a clover symbol on this the cover of this book. Hey, just like... Oh, my book! Gosh, I still need to finish studying it. Oh, I know how that is. I'm a college graduate. Oh? My friend gave it to me for Solstice Day. The, de the day when... Uh, it's the day the days are their longest, the, day, the part of the year where... The sun is out for the longest period of time, so to speak. I'm a college graduate. <laughs> he's, he's the one who wrote it, actually. He's also the... Wait, you say the author? Also the one who taught me how to read. Ooh! I have a few more of his books somewhere. Wait, I need to finish this. Dang it. Did he say his father or... The author? I don't know. Maybe his father is the author. Looks like spoiled food. Oh, no! I guess that's what happened if you leave your house for three days. Oh. Close. They're cold now. I'll, I'll, I'll save them for anybody who's naughty here. <laughs> Jars full of dried moss. What are you doing with that? Fireflies! Okay. Just kick the blocks, dude. Just kick, just kick, just kick them. It's not that hard. <laughs> okay. A block is blocking your way. How does that happen? That happens in... If, if they're huge, but... Come on. I have to do everything. I do have to do everything for him. It's a jar full of worms. A jar full of beans. Okay. A jar's full of stuff. There's nothing new here. Bed, mattress. What's that? It's a plush toy. It's mine. Our friend gave it to me last year. Oh? Yeah. He has a fox, too. And she can even talk. Talking to us. What? I know. I thought she was the coolest thing ever. So he got me a fox plush for Solstice Day. What is Solstice Day, I wonder? Oh, that's nice of him. He's the a talking plush toy. That's nothing new around here. It's a fishing pole. Do you like fish, Nico? Yeah. So do we. They're good in stews. Or soups. Uh, but I know some people back home who like to eat them raw. Ew. I mean, people eat them raw here too, but they're, at least in a non-fish form, they're made into sushi or something. Ew. Yep. Okay, so you don't do that. That's good to know. <laughs> Are full of dried fish. Can I get through here? The back room is full of dust and cobwebs. Well, that's where you're supposed to go. The, the dirtiest parts of their house. That's what, Je that's what would Jesus do? 
That's the mentality I'm making here. Okay, so I guess we're done here. Sorry guys, I have other people to tend to. Oh, they're still they're just patiently waiting. Okay. Glad I could bring you home. That's, that's what messiahs do. So we got a, got a gold feather out of that. So it was a good idea to visit them at their house. Where are we now? Whoa! This is new. Hey! Hmm? I saw you going to the courtyard, so I thought I'd tag along. But, 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 same, but... Okay. You are, you are party members now, or are you just hanging out? This is the courtyard. It's got water and stuff. There's an entrance to the underground passage here. It's flooded, though. Oh man. Laundry. You can just pass right through it. You're amazing, Nico. You really are. Okay. What's this place? This is a totally new area. Oh, so many places to explore here. Oh, now they're hanging fish. Fish! 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 <laughs> it's a ball. That's mine! Oh, dude. It doesn't bounce as much as it used to, though. Yeah, get a bike pump or something. Or a ball pump. In this case, or just get her a new ball. That'd be nice. I know where to find some. Okay, nothing to see here. Okay, that's the passageway that was flooded, I guess. Wait, can I go this way? No, okay. Oh! Oh! I keep over- I keep overlooking. Or over... Listening, I guess. Keep not noticing how beautiful this music is, y'all! It was back when we were- we had Aluda following us, and it's beautiful here, too. Okay, so there's nothing to see here. Is there? Maybe I'll come back here. But yeah, I, can't, I don't find anything I can do here. Can I do something about flooding, I wonder? I just, even Messiah can't do everything in this game. He doesn't, sorry. I'm not going to tell Alula, but he doesn't actually know everything. So you guys live right near the courtyard. That's cute. What do I want to do now? I think I'm going to go take a look at that goatherd and trader. I don't know if I should trade that feather, but... Oh, I got something to write with, don't I? I need ink. But, hello, person. Two children reside near here. That's where they reside. Cool, okay. Mysteries, things connecting little by little here. I love it. I got to remember to come back for the sun, too. We're gonna, we're gonna, everybody's, everybody literally is going to need that. <laughs> you know. This is the sun. Hey, I got something to write with now. Have to write with. Okay, it doesn't count on its own. Good to know. Can we travel, I wonder? Cool. Oh! Ta-da! I need, he doesn't think anything of that? Okay. <laughs> it's just, I'm, I'm just, just ta-da, just teleporting all of a sudden. Well, he is, I mean, I keep forgetting him and me. They're not the same in this game. But he's, he's fast traveling. He's not even going, whoa, what happened, James? That was awesome! <laughs> That's what I would have put in there. Okay, here we are. Oh, so nice to see a goat again. You too, you too. Hey, I got something for you if you're interested. Would you take a feather? I'm not trading that, James. You're not trading what? What's that, a feather? Mm-hmm. Wait. Oh my stars! That is not a feather! That is a feather from the late prophet, it is. Probably one of the most sacred items there is. How in the world did you get a hold of that? Wait, I guess it would make sense for you to have one. You know, with you being the savior and all. Um, okay. <laughs> yeah, a lot of things we can just excuse here because he's the savior. Yeah, but yeah, he's, he's not gonna trade that feather. I, I wouldn't want that for him anyway. Mm-hmm, all right. If you'd like to help me herd my rams, a ward, I'll take. Excellent. To the south is a peninsula inhabited by my rams. They are all standing in unfortunate spots. You need to move them onto the darker moss. Okay. If you get stuck, ring a bell and they'll all return to their original positions. Okay, we're going to do a, do a little puzzle here. Good luck. Alrighty. So I figured it, was, it had to do with these rams in particular. So move them all to the darker moss. Okay, so those aren't holes. Good. However, I don't know if I can... I can't get through if I if I just push push that one down. So yeah, I gotta push this one all the way. Nah. Um. Hmm. 
Again, I can't look at the parts, which would which makes sense anyway. Um, okay, I got an idea. Where do I want to do that? I gotta be able to get around here. Can I get around? I can, okay. Okay. Good, okay. But, hmm. Okay, I gotta get all these without getting stuck. But um, it's not as hard as it looks. Wait, can I? No. Oh, wait. I might need to start that over. Let's see. Ta da! So you can go there. You go there. That's better to do this. Make this easy. Push you all the way down. You're making different noises. Not sure how I feel about that. Um. Looks good, I'm not sure though. Oh wait! It's this easy. Yeah. But you dare. You go here. Why do they need to be on the darker moss, I wonder? I don't know. Was that the Final Fantasy? <laughs> that was the Final Fantasy victory theme after you win a battle. That was awesome. That was funny. Ba -ba 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 -ba. You've provided a great service for all of Ramkind. In return, take this fine Ram wool. Oh, uh, thanks. It'll be useful. Everything's useful here. You're heading to the city, aren't you? Been there, done that. Are you from the city? Too cramped, you know. It's not like this place is getting any bigger with the rising waters and all. Hmm. Maybe the city isn't so bad after all. My Ram's clock at... 1,333 megahertz. What? <laughs> me too, Nico. Me too. That's, that's based on megahertz, I think. I don't know what to think of it. It's kind, of, it's kind of useless for us, maybe. Oh, can I give it back to her? No, but I bet you can use it. You might just kill two birds with one stone. Oh. Oh. I should not have said it that way. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. You can do two things at once if... I think I have something I'd like to trade. Yay. You'll take wool, right? What can this wool get me? Wool, huh? That'll get you this fine vial of... I'm not sure what this is exact. actually. I'll take it. Some sort of fabric dye? Hmm, how about it, James? Eh, I'll take it. We'll take it. I'll do it! Pleasure doing business. Pleasure doing business, that's all you say. Okay. What is it? Vial of dye. A vial of dark liquid used for dyeing wool. Can it be used for ink? Oh yeah, we can use the feather as a pen! I saw it in a picture book once. <gasps> feather pen! Pen made from dipping a feather into ink. Should we be using a family heirloom like that? I don't know. But would their father have wanted that? I think he would. So I still don't know if I'm gonna get stew here, but now I can get through that gate and I should probably get the sun first. I don't know if we're even allowed to go through the gate without getting the sun. Let me see. Let's see if I can get it back real quick. And we're back to the Glen. This is the Glen, right? I don't know. I think it is. Okay, the sun's still here. I hate to ask this, but can we have it back? <gasps> the, the light's gone out! James! Do you know what happened? No. No! You... Really? She must have left it behind. We took it? I don't know if we should do that. It's a seed apparently left behind by maze. Interesting. Very interesting. I'm not sure what to think of that. A large light, but it's a design. Can I give it some light? No. Nope. Okay. Well, that takes care of that. Do I want that stew, though? I don't think I do. Do I have anything? I don't have anything to carry it in. Forget the stew. Oh, boy. That's another thing that's like the great Deku tree leaving behind a seed. In that game, he well, he didn't exactly do that, but he left behind the descendant, shall we say. That's the weird thing about plants, personifying plants. They don't give birth the same way. They don't reproduce the same way people do, so. 
kind of disturbing thoughts when you think about it. Okay. Got my son back. Why did it go out? That's another mystery. Oh. I'm heading out now. Might as well say goodbye to them. I don't know if it makes any difference, but they get to see the sun for themselves now. Okay, they don't say anything new. Okay. Well, let me go real quick, see if I can still get some stew for myself. Oh, have I met you before? Okay. I'll pass for now. And I will pass on to the next <clears throat> realm, shall we say. I didn't come out right, but the gate. Is, is this where I wanted to go? Yes, here we are. I can write my name now. You found something to write with. Yes, yes, yes. I can use it, apparently. James, I'm too tired to go on right now. Dang it! Please let me nap for a bit somewhere. I remember seeing a room to the west. It looked like a it might be a good place to take a rest. Okay, but what if somebody lives there? We're just... We're just assuming they're okay with us using the bed. And that's how video games are sometimes. Okay. I'm a little tired from walking. Is that right? If I take a nap, please do. No! Okay, yes it is. And it closed. Dream sequence again. I love these. There's all that weed again. Hmm. <gasps> What'd you see? Oh. Is that his town? His hometown? Oh, is that it? <gasps> James, I had another dream! I saw. Did you see this one too? Yeah. I get yeah, it doesn't sound like something I would say. I was in a big field, like the one in my last dream, and I saw my village! But then I woke up. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I don't think this world has anything like that. I mean, big wheat fields. I, the only big plants I've seen here are a bunch of weird trees. Oh, that's not very nice. <laughs> and those balls of moss floating in the water. Wait, is moss even a plant? I think it is. Say, have you seen a wheat field before, James? Yes. Well, have I? Yeah, I live in Kentucky. Oh! Not sure if it's wheat, but I've seen crops. They're really pretty, aren't they? So this is where we get to have a little... Every, after every dream, we get to get a little... Chat, a little heart-to-heart -heart with good old Nico. The one around my village goes around for miles. The plants are really tall. Sometimes I can't even see through them. When it's windy out, the winds can make waves in it. It's like an ocean, yeah. Of food! Oh, wait, but there's food in regular oceans, too. <laughs> it's not made of the food, though. Like fish or crabs? I've never actually been to a real ocean until now, actually. So you get some new experience. Have I... I haven't been to the ocean. I'm gonna be honest here, I haven't. Oh! I guess we have that in common, James. But you're kind of seeing the ocean now? In this world, anyway. It's not the same, but yeah. As for me, I've seen them on TV before. Never thought I'd get to ride a boat through one. The water back home doesn't have glowy stuff like how it is here, either. Ah, but I guess it's because the world is already so dark. You know, I used to be scared of the dark, James. It's a little hard to imagine that now, after spending so much time here. Can't you see in the dark, though, with your glowing cat-like eyes? I don't know. But not long ago, I couldn't even go to sleep without a lamp. Oh, well, that I can do with. It's good you got over that. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> Otherwise, I wouldn't last long here. Then again, I've been carrying around the sun, so it's not too bad. <laughs> and also, I don't feel scared at all with you guiding me. You don't know what that means to me. So, thanks for that. I mean, I kind of do that to play the game. Anyhow, anyway, we should head out now, James. Yes, we should. Alright, yeah, I'm ready for some new surroundings. These are nice ones, nicer than the bare ones. But it's time to get closer to our objective. Of saving a new world. I found a pen! Sort of. Good. Please write your name here. N I K O. Progress to. Okay. Good luck. Good luck, okay. Thanks. 
more grassy area. Don't worry, people, I'll be back. I'll be back. On the third day, I will come. No. The, the rapture, I will be back. I know, he's not really Jesus. Uh, it's funny to think of a, just a little kid being a savior of the world. It's nothing new in video games. They There's a little link. There's... Ah! What in the world? What in this world, you mean? Don't touch that, Nico. We gotta get out of here. Run, Nico, run! There's gonna be more popping up here, isn't there? So we can't go back now. I don't like that. I don't like it. I don't like that, Raymond. Why am I talking about that? Oh my gosh. It's getting all horror-esque on us. <gasps> Time for another oh moment. Lies, but he's never seen a big city. Technically, neither have I, just on TV. Are you not going to look at this? Whoa, loud steps. So like I was saying before the <laughs> the squares appeared. There's, there's little little heroes like Link, Ness, and Lucas from Earthbound. Our mother, as they say in Japanese, um, in Japan, sorry. Um, and of course, Sonic, he's only like a teenager, from what I remember. He's not a little, but you, you get the idea. But Nico's the sa is already called the savior before he even came here. Before he even saved anybody yet. Ah, uh, the sun. Hello, Messiah. Welcome to the refuge. Do you understand what you must do here? No. I'm supposed to go inside the tower, right? Well, yeah. I already see the tower. So I guess we must be close. Where's the entrance? On the surface. The surface? Look down, small one. Ooh, we're pretty high up. Don't look, don't look. I guess I gotta get down a lot of stairs. Or find an elevator. Correct. However, the tower is a sacred place. Finding the entrance may be easy, but that alone will not be enough. What do you mean? Once you reach the surface, I recommend visiting the library for leads. Alright. Thank you! Off you go then. I wish you luck. He look, looks rusty on the... I'm afraid this area is off limits for you, but he's the Messiah! That here. He looks more rusty up close than here on the main screen. Only the bearer of the sacred kernel is permitted access to the garden. We have the sacred kernel, don't we? Oh man. Oh, like a kernel of corn? I have this. It was left behind by the plant lady in the glen. That is indeed the kernel. Then it is your duty to regrow her. Do you understand what you must do? Regrow her? Um, no. Take the seed to the garden. Plant it in the pot in the center. You may now pass through here to access the garden. Okay. So what would have happened if I didn't get that seed? I don't know. Maybe you had to. Maybe you'd be like, no way, we need to pick up that seed, James. Okay, so where does this take us? That's a big question. Oh, missing bridge, missing bridge. Don't look down. Don't look down. Is that water? That's red looking water. I guess it's, it's like a sunset going on here. Okay. Are we going upstairs or downstairs? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, there's a pot. Okay. This looks like a big altar here. So I get the feeling this isn't enough. I think we gotta get like soil and stuff. But let's see what happens. And to put the seed in the planter. There's no dirt in this pot. Will the seed really grow like this? Yes, it will. No, it won't. Oh, okay. So I, it's there. Don't nobody touch it while well, we're gone. Okay, well, let's get some stuff. Get some progress made here. I like it. There's, they look like side quests, but I think most of the things you do, you have to do to make progress. So there's, you can't, can't really miss much in this game. I like that. Okay, what's down here? Down, down, down. So we can't actually just go all the way down. What was that? Come on! Come on! Work already! Try, you're trying, you, you have a computer, don't you? No, that's not what you need. Huh? What was that? Oh, 
Oh gosh, that's gonna hurt my voice doing his voice. Oh, the sound effects, y'all. Hey, there he is. <clears throat> for this uh excuse me <gasps> he's a tall guy whoa you're do oh, geez i didn't think i was gonna run into this is embarrassing or er, is there uh anything i can help you with yes please i would like to know how to get to the surface yeah i was afraid you were gonna say that right now this elevator is the only way to access the surface but yeah, just take a look at it. it. It looks like an elevator. Well, you're not wrong, but go look at the button panel. I am not the button panel. <laughs> it's an elevator, but it's not the button panel. Apparently broken. Ah, huh, there aren't any buttons. Yup, that's a problem. There's usually a big button here that says ground on it. You know, because it takes you to the ground area. And now it's been ripped out. There's something. I tried looking everywhere for it. To no avail. Maybe it exploded. Do you think we'll have to make a new one? What? How? We'll figure it out. Then make a makeshift button. Okay. Hmm. It's been ripped out. How come there aren't any broken wires inside the empty slot? Well, I'm no engineer, but... It's powered by some kind of magnetic technology. I know this much. Cool. You think you'll be able to make that button? Well, no pressure, kid. You're just gonna size off. I'll just stick with my original plan for now. Time to kick the door again. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no. My foot hurts. Uh, okay. Let's fix the elevator. Let's be, fix it, Felix. Let's do it. I'm losing so much time. Probably two minutes of work already. Oh, that's a lot for some of us. I hate this. So I got two goals now, get the get the elevator working and get that seed growing. Regrow her, whatever the crap that means. Let's see where this takes us. I'm just gonna go this direction because I feel like it. Okay. Ooh, oh no, not the squares. You're destroying the bridge now. What is the deal with them squares? And that computer. Ooh. I'd at least say something about the view here if I was here. Um, can we go this way? Yes. What is this place? That's well, locked. I assume it's with that door, but that noise means there's one with the light on. Oh man, we got all kinds of branches in this area. <gasps> Hello? Is this somebody's hotel suite? An abstract painting. Whoa. A landscape painting. Hey, you've got red light. Are you an intruder? Because if you are, I am model 8XN Home Security Bot, TM, serial number 39232B839W4. Oh, I, model 8XN, will have to report to you. Oh, sorry. I, I kind of just walked in because the door was unlocked. Uh, by robot logic, that makes you an intruder. Do you want me to leave? Scanning for suspicious activity. Uh oh, I see a computer. <laughs> the suspicious activity is detected. Zero. You might see some here in a minute. Well, I guess as long as I don't do anything bad. Can I take something? That would be that would be illegal. James, someone lives here. We can't just sleep in their bed. I wasn't suggesting that. We use our computer. Uh, okay. It's off. Okay. I am still monitoring you. Alert level has been set too low. Don't worry. I promise I'll be a good guest. I wiped my feet on the on the mat. Okay. Let's not go in there again. There's another door. I'm just gonna go all the way to the end of this hall. <gasps> Who are you? It's a wall of family photos. You a real person? Okay. <laughs> what? It's a, is it a person or, a, or is it a statue? I don't know what that is. It's a pink flower. Well, I know what that is. <laughs> I wouldn't have guessed that, but ooh. Is that just a toy or something? I don't know. 
with a big penguin plush. Hello, penguin. Hello. <laughs> Let me get spit on my computer again. <laughs> Why is it? What's up with all these surprise noises in this game? It's just... It's just weird. Uh, hello, penguin? Hello. Hello. Okay, bye. Can you say goodbye? Because that's what I'm saying right now. That was just weird. Oh. That's... Uh, okay. That usually means they're locked, doesn't it? Anything important in here? Oh, that was a good goodbye. Picture of many ones and zeros. Oh, that's a masterpiece for some, some people, I bet. A painting of four robots playing cards. Oh, here's that person. It looks like a person. I hope it's an actual person. Hello, would you like to play a game? Oh, sure. What game would you like to play? Hmm. Do you know rock, paper, scissors? Desired difficulty level? Huh? Desired duration of turns? Uh, please set your timer. Never mind. <laughs> it gets all complicated with machines, doesn't it? A pile of large books. One of them is a robot instruction manual. Excuse me, I'm gonna look at all your stuff before I talk to you. Okay. My parents are like literally never home. But I don't mind, I'm used to it. Besides, I got my model CWT second gen unit 4E here to keep me company now. That's, that doesn't count as company, but okay. She still talks a little weird, oh it's a she, oh. She still talks a little weird sometimes, but that's okay, she's learning. If I work real hard, she might even be tamed someday. There's that word again. I keep hearing that word. What, tame? Mm-hmm. Nobody's told me what it means yet, or me. That's just a robot thing. I can't really explain it either. Ah. Okay. So I learned a few things about... Just by talking to people. That's a, a thing I like in a game. You talk to people and you learn things. You don't just bother them. You get some funny dialogue. You actually get... Uh, information about the... About the, ga the game story. Why are you here? Oh, it's a... It's a bird person living here. A picture of a ram wearing a little pink bow. The landscape portrait of the Glen. Huh. Something's been chewing on this plant. I bet I know who and, or what. Yep, okay. What are you reading about? The title is City Life. What to expect? You're from the country. Nice. And it's not that far from the city. It's just like a few steps away. It remains of a potted plant. I just moved here from the Glen. Things are so different in the city. You've been to the Glen, right? Yeah. Everything's so green back there. I really miss it. My neighbor gave me some plants to cheer me up, but... I should probably get a muzzle for Betsy there. Betsy, you maybe keep getting plants or it'll start eating up your books, too. The entire plant was eaten. Not much is left of this plant. Oh. And this time it's not the end of the... It's not the... Whatever the cataclysm's fault. It's just a goat. It's not whatever the state of the... Oh! Oh, a little sweeper. Is that thing gonna report? I'm not sure what this is. It's like a little car. You should ride on it. Resist Earth. Mm. Mm. I don't think we should do that. It's tempting. I would totally be tempted. I wasn't going to, James. You should ride on it. What? Do it! Um. Yeah. Hey, come on, no, it was worth it. Ah, uh, what's over here? It's off. Hey, oh. I, okay, but am I controlling it or is he controlling it? Am I, am I controlling him? Controlling it? That's so weird. Okay. Well, that was fun. Thank you. We ride at dawn. <laughs> oh, that was hilarious. Do it. I. I feel like I'm a bad influence, but that was totally worth it. The pilot plants. So where do all these staircases go, I wonder? This one has a pink flower on it. Yeah, I can see that. Oh, an arboretum of sorts. Um, why do you have a pot on your... Hello there. What the heck? You have a lot of plants, and you are one. I do. Grew all of these myself, you see. Feel free to ask me about them. Oh, you're a gardener, right? Yep. Do you happen to have any dirt? For growing plants, I mean. Yep. Do you need some? Yes. I'm supposed to plant this seed left behind by a plant lady. But the pot in the garden doesn't have any soil, and it's the only pot, for some reason. I see. I know who you're talking about, yeah. Here, take this whole bag. Thanks. Oh, that was easy. Most of the plants in our world tend to grow in the glen. 
even if it's facing the flooding issues, it's still in better conditions than the other two areas. The Barrens is, well, the Barrens. And Refuge City, Refuge City is what it's called, has been, there's barely enough ground to stand on, let alone grow stuff. On a larger scale than this, I mean. You don't say, oh, let's see that thing here. Dirt. I got the dirt, yo. Mega dirt for growing plants. Okay, we're gonna need more than that a bit. Small garden trowel. The handle part is cheap like an owl? It's an owl trowel. I get it. <laughs> that's adorable. That was an adorable face, Santa. That's an adorable moment right there. Ah, black clovers. They'll be the only plant hardy enough to survive naturally outside the glen. Oh, you got cacti here. Personally, I think they're really boring to look at. One of my customers really loves them, though. I think all of the black clovers I'm growing here are for him, actually. Come to think of it, I haven't seen him in a while. I wonder when is he, when is he coming to pick these up? Hmm. Bill with plant clippings. Okay, and a watering can? It's half full. I like your attitude. Okay, <laughs> it's a sink. Cactus. 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 Wait. Uh, okay. What was that about? Characters. That's a phosphor tree. That's what that's called. Okay. Oh, like the ones we saw in the glen. I always wondered, where are the leaves? They're not dead, are they? Oh, not at all. Although these trees are composed of a woody tissue, they're closer to grass, anatomy-wise. Ha! Huh. So the branches are actually leaves? Sort of. It's like your head's a pot. What's interesting about these plants is the amount of phosphor sap they can generate. Phosphor sap. Phosphor. That's the glowy stuff, right? Yep. You know your stuff, don't you? Phosphor. And phosphor can store light energy and slowly emit it over time. Luminescence. Most of the phosphor from this world still contains energy from before the sun went out. Thank God. I mean, yeah, thank God. Without the sun to recharge them, though. Well, let's talk about something else. Okay, so, is it a tree? Only in name. Ah, that which we call a tree. It's wheat! Why is it in a flower pot? Well, doesn't it look nice? It's a wheat pot. I guess. I'd like to stand in the middle of the wheat field back in my village. It goes on for miles! Ah, oh, I wish I could have seen it. I could show you a picture if you want. In our world, what wheat is only grown in small, isolated plots. Or in a flower pot. Yep. It's wheat. That golden color is quite something, no? Oh, yeah. This tree has leaves. Uh, most of them do. Ah, yes, true foliage is hard to come by nowadays. You hardly ever see trees like these in the wild anymore. And the ones you do see are pretty much all raised artificially by people like me. Mostly for nostalgia purposes. Oh, it's like a, like a museum of plants. Small tree with leaves. Apparently they are rare. Okay. Empty flower pot. That clover guy, he's actually pretty cool. He's an author. <gasps> But apparently he's done some some sort of a sort of a big deal, or at least he's really passionate about his work. Hmm. I don't know him that well, although sometimes I stumble across articles about him in the news. I'd love to chat with him if I run into him again. How? Speaking of which, how do you see while you're while you're moving around? Good luck with that seed now. Well, thank you. Is that all you have to say? Be sure not to touch these. These are the plants that. These are the plants. Have only recently sprouted. Okay, that was actually a typo or something. It's not easy for a plant to make it out make it out there these days. We got these growing lamps, but they're a poor substitute for the sun. The pots are labeled with different species names. Oh, the sprouts are stretching towards the sun. Oh, okay, get away, get away. Whew. All right, that guy knows his dirt, doesn't he? <laughs> and his plants. But I think. Let me see. Is there anything else over here? How long, how far does this go? Okay, that's the end. Okay. So, much as I'd love to continue exploring, I am going to cut it short here. We're learning a lot, and finally, learning so, some things about the mysteries. Still don't know what taming is. Apparently, we might have just learned something about the author. And we didn't see that entity in the computer this time. But we made some progress, and that always makes me happy. We got a long way to go, seems like. But I think we're getting close to, cl closer to that tower and from what I remember that's a very exciting part of the game so or interesting at least but still enjoying this very much hope you all are too and thank y'all so much for watching till next time adios amigos god bless I'll see you around
Come on. Mm. Mm.